It's the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia, with your host, Bob Snap. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia. I appreciate you being here. Um, today's video is on James Best, uh, things you may not know about him. Uh, you have to know he's a great actor. He is always that. Anyway, let's take a look at it. Okay, James Best. He was a former military policeman and served in Germany after the end of World War II. Uh, before, he, before she took up acting, Lindsay Wagner babysat for Best's children. It was Best who encouraged Wagner to take acting lessons and, in effect, kick-started her career, and she later became the bionic woman. Uh, director Quentin Tarantino has said that the work of Best taught me how to act. Ironically, when Tarantino appeared in a 1990s Broadway revival of the play, Wait Until Dark, he received some of his worst acting reviews ever. He was a black belt in karate. Uh, he formed the first high school to teach actors motion picture technique in the 70s. And he taught in Hollywood for 25 years and worked with such prominent stars as Burt Reynolds, Clint Eastwood, Gary Busey, Terry Garr, Lindsay Wagner, Farrah Fawcett, and Quentin Tarantino. In the early 1970s, he decided to take a semi-retirement and became an artist in residence at the University of Mississippi. During his two years there, he taught motion picture technique and drama, directed four plays, and established the Mississippi Film Commission, and was elected to the University Hall of Fame. He's the sixth of seven children. His mother died when he was three. And he was taken to an orphanage when his Kentucky-born coal mining father, an alcoholic, could no longer keep the family together. He was adopted at age five by Armin and Essa Best of Indiana. Uh, he's a cousin to the singers, uh, the Everly Brothers. Um, he and his wife, Dorothy Best, along with Kevin Lang, have formed their own production company called Best Friend Films. Uh, the company is specialized in high-definition production. <clears throat> featuring Panasonic Varicam with a Pro 35 lens adapter, which enables them to use Panavision 35mm film lenses on a digital camera. They also featured an HD online edit suite, making them a one-stop shop in HD production for the independent producer. His billing for Three on a Couch in 1966 read, Introducing James Best, despite the fact that he had been in movies for 16 years and had appeared in over 30 films. In 84, in an episode of the Dukes of Hazard, the Dukes in Hollywood, Roscoe, played by James Best, and Boss Hogg, played by Sorrel Brook, uh, are discussing who should play them in a fictional movie about Hazard County. Roscoe picks Burt Reynolds. Reynolds is a former acting student of Best, and the two had been friends for many years. Coincidentally, Reynolds later played Boss Hogg in the Dukes of Hazard movie. I uh, moved to Florida in 87 and taught on campus at the University of Central Florida. He was also appointed to the Advisory Council for the Motion Picture Television and Re uh, Recording Industry of Florida. In 92, he was a recipient of Florida's Crystal Reel Award for Best Actor in a Dramatic Series for an episode in the Heat of the Night in 1988 with Carol O'Connor. Last but not least, he was the son of a coal miner. And that's all I got for you. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you found it interesting. Uh, don't forget classic sitcoms, facts, and trivia. I would move on with this about the contest, but my voice is leaving. Have a great day. God bless. I'll be praying for you.